Uh, I just love me a good self-care day. Literally, it just makes me so happy. another self-care with me video I'm so excited I'm actually thinking that I'm gonna continue to do like random self-care with me videos where I can share different aspects of self-care the last time I did a self-care with me video it was more about scalp care and like skin care today I really want to focus on like specifically acne prone skin care you can see I have it's that time of the month y'all so I have a couple of breakouts that I'm really trying to manage so I want to share with you a couple of my favorite masks, serums, treatments, all the things specifically for acne prone skin and then we're also gonna get into this hair. I've been wearing these twists for the last couple of days so it's time to wash and bring the curls back and so today I'm actually gonna be trying a brand new brand, Curl Mix. Not like it's a brand new brand in general but new to me. I've never used their products before but I've been seeing them on Instagram. I have been eyeing their things for so long so I'm very very excited. So we don't get into all of that, very, very hype. Let's just do this. All right, so first things, absolutely first, when it comes to self-care, I feel like having a really nice, plush, beautiful robe really sets the tone, honestly. You cannot do like a self-care day at home without one. This is actually a new one that I just bought from Amazon and I'm obsessed with it. If you see me like continuously just filling it up during this video, just let it happen because it feels really good. <laughs> it has like these really cute details, like look at this cuff. Look at, you know, it's just, I love it. And I also really, really love the color. It's the neutral vibe for me. So I'll go ahead and link that in the description box below in case you guys are interested in checking that out. The first thing I wanted to do today is actually get into the skin. I've been a little bit busy and all over the place. So I haven't done a face mask in the longest time ever. So we got to dig into that right now. Before we jump into my favorite detox mask, let's quickly cleanse first. My all time favorite thing at the moment is this daily microfoliant by Dermalogica. If you have acne prone skin, if you have dark spots, like these aren't even active bumps right now. They're literally just dark spots from last month's cycle. Um, but if you have any issues like that, just problematic skin in general, you are going to love this. It's so it is an exfoliator, but it is gentle enough for daily use, which is why I, I literally use this every single day, sometimes twice a day as well, y'all. Like, it's so good. So it is a powder. Let me go ahead and show you. So you just pour out a little bit into your hands. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Let me not try and spill any on the ground because this is like my holy grail stuff. I don't want to waste any of this. Um, but basically you just go ahead and mix it with water and then rub it in your hands until it gets really nice and foamy and Then once you got the foam going just apply it directly to your face and really rub it in So exfoliation is really good Especially for problematic skin because it's really encouraging The dead skin cells on the top of your skin to just go away It's getting rid of all of that and then encouraging like new skin to come up to the surface So that's why it's really really good for dark spots, for acne, for any kind of, like I said, a problematic skin, this is going to be the bomb.com. And again, I really, really love it because it's still, it's super gentle, but still like really gets the job done. So literally this is my morning routine every single morning actually. I just love to start my day with some daily microfoliant. Dermalogica is the plug, okay? I love all of their skincare, but if I had to pick a favorite, it would be this. So then once we've given it at least a minute to really work into the skin, get the enzymes to do their thing, then we can just go ahead and rinse it off. Oh, this literally leaves my skin feeling so soft every single time, like, ugh. All right, so now it's about time for detox for the skin. I usually, on a regular basis for me, because I have acne prone skin, combination skin, I like to use this mask, a detox, at least twice a week. That's usually how I do it. And the fact that I've gone for so long without doing it at all, it just, I'm appalled at myself. <laughs> so I'm very excited to dig into this today. So this is the Youth to the People Super Clay Purify and Clear Power Mask. So this is what it looks like. It's literally filled with charcoal and all kinds of like amazing ingredients. I absolutely love 
used to the people. You can trust that they're always putting like top-notch clean ingredients in their stuff. Um, I also love the fact that their products come in these glass containers, so really, really great for the environment as well. So I'm just using my little face mask brush. This is actually one that I can't remember where I picked it up from, but I'll link it for you guys in the description box below. It's just a little silicone brush and it just makes it so much easier to apply face masks. Like I don't even know how I applied face masks before this thing. And it was like only like, I wanna say like five, six bucks or something. Don't neglect like, the outer layer of your face like right here this is all skin on your face that also needs to be detoxed so don't neglect that part either y'all one of the things i really love about this mask is that it is not it's not your regular regular clay mask i mean it is technically a clay mask but it's like clay mask on steroids like i said used to the people always jam packs their products with amazing ingredients but also it is a comfortable wear clay mask you know what i mean you know those ones that like dry out your skin and it's like sitting there and you just feel like your skin is like in a desert or something and it just needs moisture because the clay mask is just like Arr! this one doesn't feel like that and i really really love that about this and this is why i can get away with using this twice a week for my problematic skin <laughs> so detox is something that i feel like a detox mask is something that everybody needs in their skincare routine and this is definitely my favorite product for that um but yeah like if you have problem skin like me or even if you don't necessarily have problem skin but if you wear makeup every single day or if you work out every single day like it's really important to make sure that you're giving your skin a really nice deep cleanse every once in a while so i feel like this is literally something that everybody could use Ta -da! super cute right i know so i'm gonna go ahead and leave this on for 10 minutes while we're letting this sit and do its thing let's go ahead and unbox these curl mix products i'm very excited to dig into these for my hair super cute Ooh, i love this hello they sent through a 10 percent off code in here that's always really nice. So the code is pure and there's no minimums, no expiration. It's one way you can get 10% off if you guys see me use these and you wanna try them yourself. I also love the diversity in this. Boom, bam, chicka, wow, wow. Okay, so they sent a total of four products. The first two is a shampoo and a conditioner. So it's a pure aloe vera shampoo. It's clarifying to remove buildup and the fragrance is watermelon. So this is step one, super, super cute. I'm excited about the aloe vera. I think, I feel like my hair really, really loves aloe vera. And then we've got a pure grapeseed conditioner. This is hydrating with ultra slip. Love to hear it. Also watermelon fragrance. Let me, let me go ahead and smell this. Legit. It smells like watermelon candy. You know any kind of candy that is watermelon um, flavor? That is exactly what this smells like. So for styling, we've got a pure avocado moisturizer. It's for hair growth. It has organic hemp seed oil. It does smell the same, like it's got a, a tinge of the watermelon, but it's definitely a lot more lightweight, and I kind of like that about the styling products. Then, last but certainly not least, I love good gel, so I'm very excited. It's a pure flaxseed gel. Also for hair growth, also has organic hemp seed oil, and also says the same watermelon fragrance. Let's really get into this gel really quick. I'm like really intrigued because it seems really unique, like different from anything else that I've used. Do you see how liquidy this is? If I could just get my camera to focus, that would be great. There we go. Okay, so it's pretty liquidy. Pretty runny. Um, it does have some stickiness to it, which is great. I just know that this is gonna offer that curl definition that I like. My thing is how much hold are we gonna get from this gel, you know what I mean? Like I know some gels will offer um, curl definition, but not necessarily as much hold as I would want. So I'm hoping that we can still get like a good amount of hold with this. This mask is not fully dry yet. It's starting to dry down, like I can feel it, but again, it's just so flexible. It's not like killing my skin. Um, so it feels really good, but I am gonna give it an additional five minutes to dry down, and then I'm gonna actually meet you guys back in the shower so we can rinse it all off and get into this wash day. All right, so we are basically fully dry now. It's like fully, fully dried down. 
It has been at least 10 minutes on my face now, so I'm ready to go ahead and rinse this off. Let me give you a quick close up. Like it's literally, I feel like it's actually like pulling stuff out of my pores. I just, I love this. I'm obsessed with this product. <laughs> so let me just go ahead and rinse it off so we can go ahead and get into some curl mix. Curl mix. I'm actually gonna go ahead and take my hair out now so that we can rinse my face and my hair at the same time. All right, skin feeling amazing. Now it's time to dig into the shampoo. I'm very excited. If you guys have seen my updated hair care regimen video, ooh, why can't I get this open? Okay, got it. So if you guys have seen my last updated, like brand new way that I style and wash my hair, I basically mentioned how important shampoos are to me. So I'm really excited to give this a try and see like how it is. Already giving a really good lather. Oh my gosh. I also feel the need to kind of comb it through my hair because I feel like it almost has, dare I say, a little bit of slip. That's nice, it's kinda nice. I do smell the watermelon. Smells really lovely, but again, I am still grateful that the styling products are like slightly less strong. It's a pretty like boom, like watermelon candy. <laughs> watermelon sugar, ah. Uh. What a minute, sugar. Ah. I'm feeling like we're gonna get a deep cleanse, but also some added moisture from the shampoo, which is exactly what I love to get from a good shampoo. Woo, okay, fully cleansed. Y'all see this leg? Quick leg check though. Ooh, oh. I noticed that my hair is not itching right now for conditioner, although we're still gonna go in with conditioner. It doesn't feel like stripped or anything like that and those are the only types of shampoos that I like to use, okay? So very, very happy about that. Also just staring at my length really quick because wow, because wow, why can't it just dry like this? <laughs> Um, anyways, let's go ahead and dig into this conditioner. So just looking at the bottle and I just noticed how short the ingredients list is for the conditioner. Let me see if I could show y'all. This is it right here. Those are all the ingredients and I usually like to see that. It just makes me feel like we're getting a more natural product that's less packed with like a bunch of stuff, you know what I mean? So it's only like the necessary things in here. So I'm kind of expecting something nice from this. For conditioner, I really look for something with a lot of slip. Like lightweight consistency, but deep moisture and a lot of slip. So here's what the consistency looks like. It is very, very lightweight, which is typical for just a regular conditioner. And it feels really good. I've actually really been loving lightweight conditioners for my hair lately. Ooh, it's the slip for me. Oh wow, the slip in this conditioner is really, really nice. My fingers are just kind of gliding through these curls right now and it feels really, really good. Oh, cur okay, so I think the conditioner is my favorite so far. It feels really good. It's just, it's just giving everything it needs to give, honestly, without doing the most. That's the best way that I can describe it. It just feels amazing. You can see my curl pattern is popping. It's looking good. So this wash is really off to a great start so far. So I'm just gonna go ahead and let this conditioner sit. I'm gonna finish up my body products here in the shower and then I'll meet you guys outside the shower to finish up with our skincare and then also get into some styling. By the way, if you guys are interested in seeing like a self care with me video, all about body care products. I have a lot of like staple, clean, non-toxic body washes, body scrubs, all the things, even body serums. So if you guys would be interested in seeing that, I'll definitely create that for you. Just make sure you comment that below and let me know and I'll come through. Okay, so first things first. My hair feels amazing. It feels super soft. I fully rinsed out all of the conditioner and it just feels it feels so good. It just feels moisturized and nice and you can see the curl definition is popping and I'm really loving this so far, but before we actually get into styling my hair, I'm just gonna clip it up for a bit. 
so we can finish off our skincare first. And there's a brand that I wanted to introduce to you guys that is thebomb.com and I love it because it helps me keep my skincare regimen really nice and simple. Like I'm literally just gonna use two products on my face now and that's it. But it has been really, really amazing. So this is Rose MD. You can get her products at Sephora. Black owned, she's Jamaican, so Caribbean owned as well. And I live. We actually found out, funny story, that we are family members, like somewhere down the line, it's crazy. Like me and Dr. Rose Ingleton herself are family, basically. <laughs> but yeah, no, obsessed with her products. So I'm just gonna go in with this one first. This is the blemish control i've actually been using this for like a month and a half at this point now um so i'm kind of gonna have to like squeeze out what i have left in here i need to restock asap because this isn't literally that good um but the differences that i've noticed is that i have less issues with i have like less bumps when i have my hormonal acne breakouts that's what i've noticed like yeah i have like one and two active bumps right here but it used to be a lot more it used to be like Two here, two here, two here, you know what I mean? But it really lessened the amount of bumps and also helps for when I do have these active bumps that helps to like nip them in the bud really quickly. And it's also one of those acne serums that does not dry your skin out. It does not, it's like not super harsh. It's just, I absolutely, I just love it. I can't say enough good things about this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and give this like 60 seconds to just absorb into my skin before we jump on in. To moisturizer, moisturizer is also going to be Rose Ingleton MD. This moisturizer is incredible. With consistent use, I've noticed that my skin is like, it's so juicy and so glowy. It's just an amazing moisturizer. It's called her signature moisturizer and it is a little bit on the pricier side, but I'm telling you, it is worth it. So here it is, not too thick not too thin it's literally perfect i use this day and night and it's just so delicious Ta -da! and that's it sometimes you know a nice little simple skincare regimen is all you really need especially if you're like me and you have problematic skin you don't want to over complicate with like 5,000 different products so this is basically what i'll be doing today i do have to go out on the road so i'm not going to be putting on any acne treatments on today but i did want to mention two for you that i think are absolutely amazing i wear these every night whenever i have a pimple this is what i'm putting on it it is the peace out acne stickers oh no they call them acne healing dots so this is what they look like get this to focus and that's it so you literally peel it off stick it on top of the bump and it literally just sits there and treats it so i like to use this overnight another drying acne product that i really really love is this one here by Kate Somerville. This is their Eradicate Acne Treatment. I'll link both of these and everything else that I've mentioned in this video down in the description box below in case you do want to shop. But this is the bomb.com as well. So sometimes I'll do a little combo. And actually last night I did that. So I went in with this drying lotion, let it sit for about like two hours. And then I rubbed it off and then stuck on the sticker and went to sleep with the sticker on it. And let me tell you, it works like a charm. So this is basically what I use for active bumps and it helps to just nip them in the bud really. So let's get into some styling. I'm very excited to style this. So they did give us two styling products. We have the leave-in conditioner and then the flaxseed gel. Um, if you guys did see, again, I'm gonna mention my updated regimen video. If you haven't seen it, you really need to go ahead and check it out because I've really kind of switched things up with my hair a little bit. Uh, but in there I mentioned that I don't really use cream products to style, like not like directly on my hair anymore. I just prefer to just go in with water and straight gel now and it's just been working amazing for my hair. Uh, but what I will do is, I think I might pump a little bit of this into my spray bottle just because I looked at it and it has cannabis sativa, so hemp seed oil, and then also avocado oil in here as well. And those are two things that I think my hair is gonna absolutely love. So I didn't really want it to miss out on those ingredients. Let me see. Oh, so the gel itself does have the organic hemp seed oil, and then obviously the flaxseed. It's like a pure flaxseed gel, but it doesn't have the avocado oil. So I literally wanted to include just a little pump of this, just a little smush, 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 into my spray bottle just so we can get a little bit of avocado oil action. When I say a little pump, I mean, skirt. Little pump, that's it. So I think we're good to go. Just my spray bottle and the flaxseed gel, and that's it. Simple skincare routine, simple hair care routine. 
That's me in a nutshell. I love, if I can simplify something, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Before we start to style, I'm just gonna quickly throw on my satin robe over my plush robe. I love the feeling of the plush robe, but my hair does not. So sometimes the plush can cause like your under hair, like all of under here to get like super frizzy and stuff from a wash and go. So in order to try and avoid that, I just stick this on. So I still get the nice, cozy feeling of my plush robe, but then my hair is still being protective by the satin. So I'm gonna go ahead and section this out. I'm really excited to get into this gel. It seems like it's gonna be amazing. My only reservation with the gel is that sometimes with flaxseed gels, I don't get as much hold as I want, so my curls don't last as long as I would want them to. But maybe this one is different. All right, so here's the first little section, moment of truth. When I'm using new products, I kind of like to start with extra small sections just so I can make sure you know I'm getting the product in there and then as I'm styling I can decide okay maybe I can do bigger sections or whatever I just kind of you know switch it up as I need to I can feel it starting to define these curls even more look at that that's really pretty it feels really good in my hair but again I just am I gonna get the hold I don't know we're gonna have to wait and see what I'll probably do is like do a day two as an ending to this video so you guys can see like how it actually lasts and what the hold has really actually done for us. But it looks so pretty and it feels really good. Just nice and like moisturizing in my curls. It almost feels like a hybrid between a leave-in conditioner and a gel. Like it's just, I don't know, it's just so different from anything I've ever used. All right, so here are the results so far. My hair is super, super defined. It feels really good. So I'm really interested to see how this is gonna dry. But so far, it's pretty good. Um, I feel like we have minimal frizz. And I feel like we may actually be able to get a really good mix of curl definition and volume with this. So I'm really, really excited. My hair feels good. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and diffuse and I will check back in a little bit later once it's fully dry. And then we'll do the final, final results on day two because that way we can get like, you know, into the final results of the hair, but also final results of these active bumps here as well. And I'll check in with you guys in a little bit. All right, so quick hair update. It is many hours later. I went out, went to dinner, so it's like, Proper nighttime, my hair is 100% fully dry. And can we get into these results so far? It is popping. And I still see a lot of potential for volume to happen, some more on day two. So yeah, just a super quick check in. Tomorrow we can also do a quick check in on these bumps. I feel like the swelling is already coming down a little bit. I do have a tinted moisturizer on though, so it's kind of hard to like really, really see and like judge what's going on here, but um, yeah, we'll get final updates on the skin, on the hair, and kind of see how successful this little self-care day with me really was. But so far, it's looking pretty good. Okay, here are the final results. Okay, you guys, you guys. This is such a good wash. I'm actually so pleasantly surprised. Like I told you guys, I haven't really had the best of luck with flaxseed gels, but this one is giving everything my curls feel so soft they don't feel overly stiff and i kind of really like that um but we also have like really nice curl definition but also volume up in here as well oh this is such a good good wash i'm so glad we tried curl wings finally because it's really really nice oh my gosh okay so i also purposely it did not put on anything on my face i, I just drew on my eyebrows a little bit but this is my bare skin right here. These are the active bumps that we had yesterday. They're going down a little bit. This one actually kind of surfaced yesterday, so I popped it and um, yeah, so the skin is kind of, these are like healing, they're calming down a little bit after our little self-care sesh. And yeah, basically I kind of do this routine every three to four days or so. Especially at that time of month where my skin is like really, really having some problems. Like right now, I'm really working hard to 
get rid of my acne and also get rid of the dark spots from old acne as well. I'm working hard on all that. I've even switched birth controls and all of that. So I'm just really trying to figure it out. And then maybe at some point I'll come through with a video speaking about like exactly how I got my skin all together. But um, so far, this is what I'm doing for maintaining. And it's just, I love it. 10 out of 10, 12 out of 10. Recommend everything that I shared with you in this video. So excited. Nothing like a good self care, huh? Like the day after a really good self care day, you just feel good. You love good and you just it's a vibe i just i love it <laughs> it's simple you know we all we did was hair and skincare but it means the world to me honestly it's just my favorite thing honestly me time self-care it just gets me right at least for the next like couple of days you know what i mean so yeah guys that is basically going to be it for this video. Thank you for coming along and self-caring with me today. If you guys are interested in seeing more self-care with me videos, let me know in the comments below. I'm I'm, I'm going to be coming through with some more because self-care has been such a massive thing for me and I would just love to share more of the things that I have done to really care for myself over the past, like specifically over the past like year and a half. So just comment below and make sure you let me know if you guys are interested in actually seeing that because I will come through and yeah, guys. Thank you so much for watching before you leave don't forget to subscribe and you might as well check out a couple other videos while you're here i mean why not i'll catch you guys in the next one bye